Hi guys, my name is Zora. You watch my very first video, which is basically going to be just a simple spring haul. So yeah, this is basically it. I think I'm going to give more details at this video's ending. So yeah, um, let's get started. So the first thing I want to show you, it's actually a crop top by the brand J Norman and it's on this really pretty neon green color and it looks like this and then uh, at the shoulders it has this really awesome detail like a big crop I don't know if you can tell yeah it's basically just like this and it's by the brand G Norma I think I already said that okay uh, next another neon color uh, and I think it's again by G Norman only that I've somehow cut the label yeah, so it basically looks like this. It has this awesome detail with buttons in the front and then it goes in the back with this really, really large crop and it's very loose at the bottom and I don't know, it just screams spring to me. I don't know why. Okay, the next thing, which is more summerish I think, but still, I just simply had to have it. It's this really awesome short top which has this really nice um, heart-shaped neckline. I don't know if you can tell. Yeah, like this. Uh, and it has this really pretty floral print, tropical somehow. Uh, but my favorite part about this, it's actually the back, where you can see it has this really awesome corpse all the way down. Yeah, it's just perfect and so feminine and so girly. Really, I had to have it again. <laughs> um, okay. Another top I want to show you guys, it's this one by the brand Dorothy Perkins and it's simply this really basic white shirt with no buttons and at the neckline it has this really schoolish detail which actually made me buy it uh, and it's obviously not ironed but it's just like this comfortable loose um, shirt you just have to have on okay so the next thing I want to show you guys is actually two pieces which are really I don't know they're really similar both are by the brand Amisu which sells in New Yorker and this is the first one it looks like this is just on this beige cream creamy I don't know color and it has this awesome detail in the front yeah and the next one it's again like I said pretty similar only it's on this really nice pur purple color and again the biddings and the front is a bit different but still the same style okay um, and I think this one is the last blouse yeah uh, now the last shirt it's actually a black one oops yeah like this uh, and it's just re this really basic simple black shirt um, yeah, it's a bit of a see-through, so I guess I'll just wear it with something underneath. And it has this really awesome detail in the front, which is like a bow. I think you can tell, yeah. Yeah, so this is it. Uh, next, the only blazer I've bought so far this spring. And it looks like this, it's just basically this really nice red color. Uh, and it's simple, it has no buttons in the front, nothing. It's just like this basic blazer. And it's by the brand Dorothy Perkins again. Okay, now uh, a skirt by the brand Fishbone, which again sells a New Yorker. I'm sorry for my hair, I just didn't have time to do anything about it. Okay, so yeah, it's simply this bandage skirt, really, really short, a bit high waisted, and it has this awesome zipper in the front. Yeah, and it's just on this Irish green, I think. I can't. I don't know if you can tell because of the light again. Yeah, so this is it and it's really awesome and really springish and all that. Um, okay, the next thing, it's a stop again. Uh, the last one, I think. Uh, and it's simply like this um, crop top, a bit shiny. I don't know if you can tell, you definitely can. Yeah, so it, it simply looks like this. It's a bit golden, but it's really hard to tell on this light. And it has this nice zipper oops, in the back. 
just like this and it's by the brand Topshop yeah and it's apparently made in Romania also yeah uh, one of the last things I want to be showing you guys is it's actually this really nice retro dress um, which I don't know the brand because I bought it from a local boutique or so but it's just like this basic retro grey dress with this really really awesome detail in the front and then it goes in the back with a large crop again and the bottom is again really loose and sweet and it's a bit elegant but I really needed one like that so yeah it was kind of a win-win okay now I think this was it with clothes now I do have some accessories so oh no I do have some tops to be showing you guys and another skirt sorry okay so the last skirt it's actually this one which is from a Miss Again which sells in New Yorker and it's just like this really sweet simple well not that simple but still sweet uh, black short skirt and it has this really awesome detail in the front yeah and some simple uh, tops which looks like uh, sorry oops which look like this and I've got them on different colors such as white um, I don't know some sort of pink uh, black black and navy uh, and the, I actually bought them because they were on sales and I just want to transform them a little bit to stylish them I'll definitely do a video on that but perhaps later um, yeah so now accessories 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 so yeah first bags okay so the first one it's actually bought at the ending of this winter so I don't know if that's springish but still it's one of my favorites so it looks like this I've just added this really nice scarf with an animal print yeah so it just looks like this and it's cream really uh, awesome and it looks at least to me it looks a bit um, expensive but it actually wasn't it was rather cheap so yeah it looks like this and you can wear it on the shoulder as well and the next one which I actually belongs a bit more to my mother but I just really have to show you I had to show it to you guys sorry I don't know what's up to me but with me <sighs> sorry so yeah it basically looks like this it has this really awesome floral um, print to it and it's on turquoise I think and yeah it's just really really springish unlike the other one um, and Okay, uh, and a pair of really really nice uh, platforms or however you want to call this uh, which basically looks like this it's more like of a wedge but it's really really small uh, and they are by the brand Spicy I've never heard of it but it, they were rather expensive so I think they're good quality and the awesome thing about these ones are that they have this really nice bow in the front so, and they are black and they go with pretty much everything I bought this spring, so, yeah. And the last things are mm, definitely not all from reserved, but still. First, this really... Shit. Sorry. Uh, first, this really, really nice uh, belt from reserved. And it just looks like this and you can fix it however you want this one is on the size s but it has no holes so you basically just put it how you want okay so now jewelry i didn't really buy much jewelry this time but i promise i'll show you some the next video or something like this so the first pair is actually from reserved and they look like this and they're really really awesome and yeah this is it uh, and another pair of earrings but yeah here they are I just wore them so they don't have the label anymore 
So they simply look like this. They are really, really elegant. And they are not from Reserved. They, I don't know the brand, but I don't think it's a big deal. But I just fell in love with them. And they were rather cheap, so I had to have them. And the last thing is actually this really nice bracelet. Which still has the label, but it has no brand on the label, so... Yeah, and it's basically just this really sweet white uh, matching bracelet. So yeah guys, this was basically my very first video. I hope it brought a bit of joy to your day and hopefully it gave you some ideas of what you could wear this spring. And yeah, don't be mean when you comment, if you do. Um, but you can be constructive as I obviously need lots of advices. Um, don't forget, still, this is my very first video, so I'm not that experienced, but hopefully I'm improving. Uh, so, yeah, this was it. Uh, as I said, leave me some responses, um, sorry. <coughs> leave me some responses, some comments uh, over what you'd like to see next, over how you felt about this video, what would you change about me, about the way I presented, about what I presented, and so on and so forth. Um, yeah, so this is basically it and hopefully I'll see you next time. Oh, yeah, by the way, I'm also on Facebook, Twitter and Blogspot. I'll link those below. And if you can spare a minute, you could also, uh, I don't know, read what I've been posting and like some of my pages if you want to. So, yeah, this was basically it. See you next week. Bye, guys.